his friends and in that moment father seraphim came in to greet me oh. and he gave me a tour of every uh nick and every uh, brick and every uh where somebody <laughs> had stubbed their toe in 1954 he knew it all uh, and so i think it might be that i received the last tour of this shrine from father uh seraphim before he went to the lord so it's that is a great privilege Aww. i i think of the our lord speaking to saint faustina saying this life is indeed uh one of suffering but suffering for the kingdom of god and so we say goodbye to this Bonus Miles Christi, this good soldier of Christ, building the kingdom at every corner of the world. And all that means is we need another, probably in Father Seraphim case, 100,000 soldiers to take his place. <laughs> so if you're there uh, watching uh, all this uh, and to those here gathered, pray for solemn vocations for men to follow in the footsteps of someone like Father um, Seraphim and for young women to follow in the in the role of Faustina whom Seraphim loved and uh, proclaimed as one leading him to Christ each day so on this day we we say goodbye to one but hopefully we'll say hello to a hundred thousand others that the Lord will send <laughs> <laughs> Bishop, we are deeply, deeply appreciative of your being here with us, that you are able to be the main celebrant for this funeral mass. We are grateful to you. We promise that you will be in our prayer. And I know we ask Seraphim also to, to pray, because you know the bond between us and those who pass away is never broken, that bond of love and, and, and exchange of prayer. But you know, you came to know him in that meticulousness of Father Seraphim. <laughs> <laughs> he knew every detail and he understood the incredible mind. And, and I think that perhaps that was a passing on to you. The Seraphim gave you this, this knowledge of the shrine. We're here. Yes, it's a national shrine, but in a special way, we're here for the diocese. And we're grateful for your presence. May the Lord bless you. Bless all the priests, especially some of you who are here you know, from the diocese, and we deeply, oh. deeply, again, appreciate the sisters, all of you who are here. May God take us home one day so we can share the beautiful banquet of life in glory. And that's our wish, desire, and that's what we're here for. And I know God, who is trustworthy, will make it possible for us. Thank you, Father. <laughs> Naalala ko po yung naralli mami, no? Ganyan na ganyan. Our brother Father Seraphim has fallen asleep in Christ. Confident in our hope of eternal life, let us commend him to the loving mercy of our Father and let our prayers go with him. He was adopted as God's son in baptism and was nourished at the table of the Lord. May he now inherit the promise of eternal life and take his place at the table of God's children in heaven. Let us pray also on our own behalf that we who now mourn and are saddened may one day go forth with our brother to meet the Lord of life when he appears in glory. Amen. Saints of God, come to his aid, come to meet him, Angels of the Lord, receive his soul and present him to God, to God the Most High. Receive his soul and present him to God, to God the Most High. Christ who called you to 
you to himself. May angels lead you to Abraham's side. Receive his soul and present him to God, to God the Most High. Receive his soul and present him to God, to God the Most High. In dear hands, Father of mercies, we commend our brother, Father Seraphim, in the sure and certain hope that together with all who have died in Christ, he will rise with him on the last day. We give you thanks for the blessing which you have bestowed upon Father Seraphim in this life. They are signs to us of your goodness and of our fellowship with the saints in Christ. Merciful Lord, turn toward us and listen to our prayers. Open the gates of paradise to your servant and help us who remain to comfort one another with assurances of faith. Until we all meet in Christ and are with you and with our brother forever, we ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. In peace, let us bring our brother to his place of rest. Thanks be to God. God. I'd like to just announce that uh, the uh, funeral procession will go to the cemetery, but in about 10 minutes or 10 or 15 minutes, uh, because I, we will be able to put some winter clothing here, as you know, and uh, this will conclude our celebration via stream, live streamed. Uh, the uh, the at the gravesite it will no longer be uh, making possible for all your view viewers. So we deeply, deeply thank you for sharing with us this very moment, the celebration of the funeral mass for Father Seraphim. Oh, <laughs> 